All right, gauge block stack ups. 2.6842 is the height we're trying to reach. So in gauge block stack ups, you always want to get rid of the tenths first. So up here we have a 50, a 100, a 101 tenth, up through 109 tenths. So we want to get rid of the tenths first. So the only available tenths is a 102. So 1002. 2.584. Let's pull the 102 out. That's it right there. Now, we don't have 184 thousandths block. We, we go up to 150, then the 200. There is nothing in between. So what we've got to think about is what do we need to pull out to get down to an, a decent number? So let's pull out 134. That is right here, 134, we have 2.450, oh, we have a 450 blocks. The 150, 200, 250, 300, now they're going in 50 thousandths increments all the way up to one inch, two inch, three, four. So now we have that, the 450, and that leaves us with two. We pull out the two inch. So there we have a simple one. Let's put these back. Let's go for another round here. Uh, let's do another example. Um, let's do one 1.0001. 1. 0, 0, 0, 1. 1. 0, 0, 0, 1. So you're saying, oh, that's easy. I'll just grab a one inch gauge block. Nope. We've got to pull out that tenth. And like I said, we got the tenths of 101 tenth to 109 tenths. So we got to pull out that block. 0 0.1001. That is this one. That leaves us with 900. Voila, we have a 900 block. Two gauge blocks to get that. All right. Didn't want to throw you. All right, so let's do another one. 0 0.6221. 6221. Again, let's pull out the tenth block first. 0 0.1001. Pull this one out. It is. Right here, we just had it. So that leaves us 0.522. All right, well, we got 122. Let's pull that one out. One, two, two. That leaves us with 0.4. And we have a 0.4 block, three gauge blocks. Three by eight blocks got that one. All right, let's do another one. Let's put these back. Let's do 1.1742. Again, let's pull out the tenth block. That is this one. That leaves us with one point. 074. We don't have an 074 block. So we don't have a 174 block. So we need to do it and we got to think about it in multiples of 50. So if we did a 124, which is Seven six five four one two four. We have fifteen point nine five zero oh. point nine five zero oh. is this one. All right, three gauge blocks got that. And we'll do one last one. 
just so you can see what's going on here. Point three one two five. So that we, again, we got to pull out the tenth block. One inch five. This one, I believe that's it. So we got. 0.212, let's pull out to 112. That leaves us with 0.1, and then that one will be right here. Three blocks. Let's put these black. Mix these up, QC guy will really be ticked. All right, so you can see by this example here, the first thing we do, we always pull out the tenth block, and it's going to be a 100 and 1 through 9 tenths. Pull them out first, start our subtraction going down. We have to be careful because we don't have 174. We don't, we go from, um, so we have to think in multiples of 50, and you always want to use the smallest number of gauge blocks stack for a stack up as you can get by with. Uh, if you, it's always good to go back and go forward and double check and do your math. That's gauge block stack ups.